Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Many of you have been asking for my natural makeup routine, so I said I would jump on camera and show you how it's done. This is how my face looks currently. If you would like to see how I transform this face, then stay tuned. Day one, day one. Trying to spend the rest of my life with the same ones. So to begin, I'm starting with my Milk Hydro Grip Primer. And I love this primer because it allows for a smooth application. And I also feel like it's helping my skin underneath the makeup as well. So I'm just going to apply it all over my face. And then we'll move on to my foundation. For my foundation, I'm going to be using Revlon Color Stay. And it comes in number 410, which is cappuccino. I feel like it pairs really well with my skin tone. And in this video, I'm using the normal to dry skin formula. However, I've moved on to the combination oily skin. My skin has a tendency throughout the day to get kind of oily. So I feel like the combination and oily skin formula works better for my skin now. Baby, 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 baby. You driving me wild, you driving me so crazy. Got me acting out, got me trying to stay so. For my concealer, I'm currently using the LA Girl Pro Concealer, which is a high definition concealer. I feel like it really heightens my skin complexion. It allows my skin to look very vibrant and alive. I really love this product because it helps to clear my hyperpigmentation and it is also very affordable. I think I got it for like three or four dollars on Amazon. For my eyebrows, I'm just going to be using a simple liner that I got from Dollar Tree for like a dollar, maybe a dollar twenty-five. I try not to use like really expensive liners because I'm paying a lot of money and I really don't like the application. I feel like this liner works just fine. So if it's not broken, I'm not gonna try to fix it. So I'm just gonna apply the liner to my eyebrows. I have this in, um, I think it's a brown black. And then I'll go in on the ends of my brows with a darker liner that I think I got from e.l.f. So now I'm going to go in with my concealer along the perimeter of my brows just to give it a more defined look. I'm going to be using my True Color Soft Velvet Finishing Powder. I feel like it really works wonders to highlight my face and it allows my makeup to stay on for an extended period of time. You know you're cute. So now I'm going in with my contour powder. I'm using the color scope. It's more of a mid-tone and I'm going to apply it right underneath my cheekbones. I'll also apply it around the bridge of my nose 
as well as the perimeter of my forehead and the outskirts of my face. You don't need a plan B, but to have a family, sounding like a Grammy. Every time you speak, make me want to sing. It yeah, made me want to sing. So passionate like Jackson, five heartbeat temptation. Girl, don't keep me waiting. I love you, that's Cupid. That's soul child with the music. You my boo, that's Alicia. I told you I need you, that's Jazz. And baby. So now it's time for me to apply my eyeshadow. I was going for something that was not too dramatic, but that gave it a lasting touch. So I decided to go for a maroon red, and I'm gonna overlay this silverish gold color on top. Yeah, you bet. So once you come in, talk to me. Jealousy. Trying to show you love. It's that TLC. You're my favorite song. You're my therapy. Yeah, music for my soul. Classic. to apply my eyeliner i love this h2o wet and wow eyeliner because i use the normal kind from wet and wow as well as other brands and i found throughout the day that they have the tendency to smudge or to run down my face um, and i do not want that to happen but this particular liner lasts all day and i do not have to worry about those mishaps now, y'all, for these lashes, I was definitely on the struggle bus when it came to applying my lashes. It was just difficult for me to figure out that whole process. I felt like it was in my eye. It was just weird. So I went through the process of using magnetic lashes. Those went fairly well for some time, but they just wouldn't stay on that long. So I decided to join the bandwagon and try to apply my lashes the right way. And I think I got the hang of it. For my lipstick, I'm using Wet n Wild, and the color for that is 912C, which is in the flesh. I love that color. It gives it a natural look. It has like a bright tone to it, but it's not too bright. I also use the Mochalicious color as well. I love that color. That's the 914C. Both of these lipsticks leave my lips quite moisturized and they last throughout the day. After applying my lipstick, I'll go in and apply my lip liner and then I'll try to blend it. Music for my soul, classic R&B, talk to me Jodeci, trying to show you all this at TLC And for the shimmer, I like to add my NYX Filler Instinct Lip Gloss And this is in color Cheap Feels Peep, I keep it on the low Cause no one really gotta know what we got going on I'm selfish, I want you all the time All to myself, no mic jet, but you know the girl's mine Baby, come and talk to me Trying to show you love, it's that TLC You're my favorite song, you're my therapy Music for my soul, classic R&B So my makeup is almost done, but I like to add that last and final touch I want to add a little bit of a glow to my face So I tend to use this goddess eyeshadow And I'll apply it to the tip of my nose And into the corners of my eyes It makes all the world of difference Classic R&B, talk to me I'm nothing without you. I'm nothing without you. I'm nothing without. Girl, I'm not without you. All right, guys. I hope that you all enjoyed this video. I hope it was super helpful. And until next time, love you guys. Bye. I swear I'm lost without you. All I think about is. I'm nothing without you.